Social Security Administration had bad news for Mary Kulik. 32 bank accounts opened on my Social Security number that involved fraud. At first, she didn't buy it. Then the police called and it started to seem real. They were going to come and arrest me unless I could prove to them that I did not open these accounts. In the last two weeks alone, so many of you are letting me know scammers are trying to trick you using your social security number claiming it'll be frozen or suspended because of suspicious activity. That's not how this works. The Social Security Administration will not call and threaten arrest or anything else. If you think you have a real problem, hang up, call the agency directly. It's something Mary wishes she had done. Instead, get two gift cards, $500 each. And once she gave them the numbers on the back, that $1,000 she spent was cash in the scammer's pockets, an expensive lesson she wants you to learn. Just hang up, no matter what they say, just hang up. Again, no legitimate agency is going to call and threaten you to pay. Now we've got the real Social Security Administration number. Go to kgun9.com for that. I'm Investigator Joe Ducey, got a problem? Let me know. Of course, if you have anything you want us to look into, let us know. You can call the number. We're going to have it to you on our website, kagan9.com. Go there, check it out. Lots of good information.